Hello everyone. Welcome to my The Young and the Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and the Restless spoilers predict that Audra Charles and Kyle Abbott's phony truce will not survive much longer. The trouble will begin when Nate Hastings mentions Kyle and Audra's boss, prompting Audra to interject and clarify that he means their secret donor. Audra does not want to give Kyle any leverage that he can use against her. Therefore, she is concerned that he will assume she spilled too much. Victor Newman would rather Audra and Kyle kept his role in Glissade a secret than reveal it to Nate. That is exactly why Kyle will call Victor after the slip-up during the week of September 9 to 13 and blame Audra. Kyle will finally meet up with Victor and explain why he feels Audra informed Nate about his involvement. Kyle will have the opportunity to play up Audra's dubious tendencies. If Victor can't trust Audra to keep his identity hidden, how can she be trusted to help operate this business? That is what Kyle may argue as he once again seeks the opportunity to run Glissade on his own. Even if Victor does not give Kyle that opportunity right away, he will undoubtedly keep a closer eye on Audra. Kyle will presumably put Victor on high alert, resulting in him capturing Audra as she makes a hazardous move. Audra is set to go rogue, which will not sit well with Victor. Victor is a it's my way or the highway type of guy. Thus, this could result in Audra being fired or harshly disciplined. In either case, Audra will quickly know Kyle is giving her troubles. It will enrage Audra and make her eager to react, so Kyle should be prepared for her revenge plot. Audra isn't going to stand by it and allow someone like Kyle trample on her aspirations and goals. Kyle will pay penalties for interfering with Audra's future, so we'll make guesses about how far her vindictive scheme will reach. According to the young and the restless spoilers, some surprising events are in store for Audra and Kyle's doomed relationship so stay tuned for more exciting news. The Young and the Restless spoilers for Tuesday, September 10, hint that Nick Newman will cope with new concerns concerning Sharon Newman's mental health. Nick will suspect Sharon of lying about getting back on her meds, and he will discuss this with Maria Copeland in private. Nick will argue that they must uncover the truth in order to protect Sharon and others around her, Sharon has done some crazy things when she wasn't on her medicine in the past, so Nick doesn't want history to repeat itself and bring sad news. Maria will agree that Sharon still appears strange, but she will think it is underhanded to carry out some covert plot. Sharon, on the other hand, will simply lie again if they question anything directly, thus Maria and Nick's plan should go ahead. Sharon would ultimately experience a hallucination involving another Nick smooch in her home. Sharon will kiss her former flame in her head, and Cameron Kirsten will undoubtedly analyze what it means and continue to push her buttons. Other Y and R spoilers indicate that Chelsea Lawson will suffer more repercussions, which might include coming clean to Chilo Mitchell about the events in Maryland and justifying her conduct. Chloe just received reports about Sally Spectra's breakup from Adam Newman and was relieved that she was no longer with him. Chloe resented seeing Sally in such pain. Chloe may now lash out at Chelsea for causing Sally's grief, betraying Billy Abbott, and getting back into bed with Adam. Chelsea despises the fact that she cheated, but she insists that her night with Adam was all about booze and mutual comfort over Connor Newman. Of course, Adam admitted to Sally that it was partly about love. Is this true for Chelsea as well? Sally washed her hands of Adam, but when she sees him again, she may explain her stance. Fans of Y and R may anticipate Sally to make a decision on whether or not to rejoin with Adam, but it appears she has already done so and will stick to her decision. According to the Young and the Restless spoilers, Adam and Sally's future looks grim right now, but there may be hope down the line. Regardless, our forecasts indicate that Sally will try to move on with her life in the interim. According to the Young 
and the restless spoilers, Nikki Newman continues to vet Lily Winters. In Genoa City, Wisconsin, it is unclear whether the process will end in a secure job. On a personal level, Nikki and Victor Newman enjoy Lily. They had known her since she was born. Of course, Neil Winters was one of Victor's most trusted executives throughout his career. Neil and her mother, Drusilla Winters, had a significant influence on Lily. Catherine Chancellor was equally fond of Lily, as evidenced by the handmade note Nikki delivered to her. The young and the restless spoilers, Nikki Newman wants a strong team. Victor infuriated Nikki when he removed her from Newman Media. She was persuaded that her devoted but domineering husband had made the move to placate his insecure son, Adam Newman. However, when Victor first informed Nikki that he was reinstalling Adam, he was carrying out a complicated strategy. Devoted viewers will recall that Victor formed Newman Media to assist Adam in resetting himself. The attempt lasted barely a short while. Nikki adored the prospect of running her beloved friend Catherine's business. That will happen when Victor takes control of Abbott Chancellor, as Billy Abbott now refers to it. Nikki would love to have Lily as her key executive. The young and the restless spoilers, Daybone Winters makes the call. Daybone Winters wanted his sister to stay with their family business. He wanted Billy gone, and it occurred. Unfortunately, Lily did not carry out the plan she and Daybone devised. They planned to deceive Billy after Chancellor reverted to a standalone firm. She was supposed to return to Winters, but she decided she preferred to work with him instead. Lily is extremely protective of what she built at Chancellor at the time it was united with Winters. That somewhat intices her to stay with the company if Victor takes control and wants her. The young and the restless spoilers, Lily Winters in the prime of her career. Like Neil's heyday at Newman Enterprises, Lily is at the pinnacle of her career. Victor is continually looking for new talent, but Davone is heavily encouraged to persuade Lily to return to Winters. Victor's angry conversation with Nate Hastings at Society highlighted the possibility of Lily not having a role at Newman Media. However, Lily's visit with Victor may have been enough to persuade him that she would be a valuable addition and support to Nikki. Lily wants to develop her profession and isn't interested in arguing with Davon if she agrees to work with him again. However, everyone is aware that anything in the Newman Enterprise includes drama, so the grass might not be greener there, but she appears to be willing to take the soapy bet. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. If you like my videos, please like and subscribe for more information. I'll see you guys next time.